This dataset is called Anscombe's Quartet. It is created by a statistician called uh, Francis Anscombe. And apparently he was really annoyed by other statisticians who disregarded the importance of plotting data. Uh, this dataset is carefully crafted so that each of the quartet has more or less the same summary statistics. For instance, the mean of x is same, the mean of y is same, both variances are same, the correlation between x and y is same, and even the result of linear regression are same. And there are a bunch of other statistics that are controlled. Still, you probably could notice some quirkiness in the dataset. For instance, you probably have noticed that uh, there are a bunch of same x values in the fourth dataset. But if you plot them, all the differences between dataset become so immediately clear. The first one looks normal, but others are kind of crazy examples. The second plot clearly shows nonlinear relationships. For the third one, you may want to look at what's going on with the outlier, right? And the last one is an interesting example that shows how a single outlier can completely skew the summary statistics. If you ignore the outlier, there is no correlation whatsoever between two variables. If you had relied on summary statistics only, you probably missed all these interesting patterns hidden in the dataset. So recently, there was a pretty cute study published in CHI 2017. In this study, they generalized the idea of Anscombe's quartet and built an algorithm to generate crazy shapes while maintaining the same summary statistics. So they could create uh, the head of dinosaur while maintain, maintaining every summary statistics. So be sure to check out their videos and papers if you're interested in.